Alright guys, welcome back. This is Gaming Don't Stop 96 back on the Mutt 16 on your screen. As you can see, 90 overall Julio Jones, 24 hours only. This is the man we're going to be pulling for today. Here are his stats, 90 speed, 96 catching, 97 spec catch, 93 release, 92 catching traffic, and 90 route running. So obviously an amazing card comparing to Captain Keenan. Probably a little bit better of a card. I don't know if he's 200,000 coins better. As you can see, this one's going for 350,000. Captain Keenan usually goes for around 100K. But these are. this is not the only football outsider card out today. There is a cornerback for the Bills, Stephon Gilmore, 86 overall. And let's see if we can find him here. There he is. Stephon Gilmore, 86 overall corner, 6 foot 1, 92 speed, 93 man, 89 zone, 88 press, 80 play rec, and 68 catching. Pretty decent corner. I don't believe he's going for around 70k even though this one is. Compared to Josh Norman and Malcolm Butler, who we did pull in my previous pack opening, if you like, go check that out. Uh, he's got better speed than both of them, a little bit taller, but they do beat him in the coverages. Malcolm Butler, not by that much, so decent corner. Uh, I would love to add him to the squad if we get a chance to, but the other football outsiders, we have a kicker with 99 kick power. I believe he's the first kicker in the game to have 99 power. It's uh, Brian McManus, who does play for the Denver Broncos. And I believe he kicked like two, like a 54 and a 57 yard field goal, something crazy like that. As you can see, 99 kick power, 93 kick accuracy, and 79 speed. He's about as fast as uh, Brent Grimes, cornerback for the Miami Dolphins, which is pretty crazy. Then we have Safarian, Austin Safarian Jenkins tied in for the Buccaneers, who also had a really good game. Oh, there's one right here. He's got 89 speed, 87 catching, 91 release, 85 catching traffic, 72 route running, which is pretty, it's pretty bad for a tight end, honestly. Compare him to playmaker Gronkowski. Murders him in speed, but Gronk pretty much hasn't beat on everything else except for run blocking. Even that... Safarian so Jenkins only has him by two. And the last football outsider for this week, I believe, is DeCastro, right guard. There he is. 84 overall right guard, David DeCastro. 96 strength, 91 run block, 85, or excuse me, 91 pass block, and 85 run block with 83 impact blocking. Really good right guard if you're balling on a budget. Obviously, compared to Zach Martin, I mean, he's uh, basically the gold version of Zach Martin. Probably cheaper. I might switch him out, get a little extra coins. Because as you can see, I do only have 37,000 coins right now, which really isn't that much. But let's go ahead and hop in. I got a quick 15 pro packs to go through real quick. We'll see how it goes. Hopefully, we can pull Julio, get through these auctions, trying to clean out my binder a little bit, even though it's pretty low get as many coins as I can but right now 15 pro packs to burn through hopefully we can pull Julio to Castro any good cards at least give me the lead starting off Packers Raiders defense Winks Matt Elam Panthers home Colin Lockett and Chris Baker 75 overall defensive tackle not what we're looking for 14 pro packs left let's get it come on Ray Agnew New Orleans Saints, Shaq Evans, Jeff Heath, Ken Wisenhunt, Rashard Clyatt, Lambeau Field Packers, and Danny Woodhead. All right, so still looking for a first 80 overall card, even though we're only two pro backs in. Let's see. All right, Zach Ertz, 83 overall tight end. Not that good of a card. Anything else in this pack? No. Okay. So fifth pro pack on the way right here. Still searching for a football outsiders. Craig Stevens. Not what we're looking for. Come on, man. Let's get these packs going. Let's go. Come on, man. And, ah, Frosty Rucker. Never good when the pack starts off with a gold. Usually not going to be that good of a card. All right, moving on. Not sure how many pro packs we got left. Let's hit it from the back. Get that. Good luck. And we get CJ Wilson. Another crappy card. Okay, we get two players. Miles Austin. 
And CJ Wilson, does he go in the Raiders captain set? No, he does not. So he's not going to go for anything. Usually those 72, 73, 74 overall cards, if they do go in a captain set, are so they can go for some coin. But unfortunately with him, not going to have that luck. Let's go up from the back again. All right. And we get Tyson Colombo. And we should get one more gold. All right. Antonio Allen. Really not what we're looking for right now. We do need to get some better cards. Not looking good. All right. Next pro pack. Hopping into it. All right. Alex Okafor, outside linebacker, team of the week. Decent card. But not the one we're looking for. We are looking for Julio Jones. How many packs do we have left? Seven packs. A little over halfway through the bundle. Let's get it. Going through. Ryan Mallett. Ryan Russell. Quentin Copels. 76 overall outside linebacker. And nothing else in this pack. Trenton Holiday. Amazing return, man. If you want a new kick return. I've returned so many kicks for touchdowns with him. It's crazy. Next pro pack in. Let's go ahead from the back, see if we can get any luck. Just one in a lead or something, and I'm not even going to attempt to pronounce his name. 77 overall, does go in the Patriots captain set, so maybe we can get some coin out of him. Let's see, next pack, and... Oh, Von Miller! We pulled Von Miller! Oh my god! the One of the best outside linebackers in the game! I may not get Julio this pack opening, but we did pull a Vaughn Miller. Wow. All right, I'm, that's all I need from this pack opening. I don't care who I get in the rest of the pack opening. We just pulled a Vaughn Miller. Next pack. Let's see. Can we get another Elite? Can we get another? Oh, we get Stephon Gilmore. These packs are on fire. Oh, my gosh. Can we get the? Can we keep the Elite luck going? Come on, man. Let's go. Hit it from the back. And we get, all right, we should get another gold or elite card. And we get Brandon Merriweather. All right. So two elites in this pack opening. Really nice. Good way to end these last few packs. Pat McPhee might go for, I'm pretty sure he goes for about 14K. Another good pull. See what else we can get out of it. And we get 76 overall Curtis Lofton. All right. Pretty lit pack opening. Last pro pack. Going to go from the back again. We do get... Schefter Star, which I think is such a crappy name. Just go back to Rising Stars. Carlos Hyde and Carl Klug. Bro, Klug? I feel bad for you. Anyway, we just pulled Von Miller and Gilmore. Two amazing cards. Does he go in any sets? I didn't even look. No, he does not. Okay. Man, I really want to pull another 15 Pro Packs. That was pretty lit. Ah, I'll wait. I'll wait. I'll save those pro packs. I do have another $20 on my PSN. I'll save those for the next Football Outsiders Team of the Week cards to come out. Anyway, that is the video. Did not want to go to the sets. Well, let's go check out Vaughn Miller real quick. We do got to compare him. He does go for, I'm pretty sure, go for over 100 k Really nice pull. Let's go check real quick. All right, Von Miller, left outside linebacker. How much is he going for? 198K. Wow. Wow, what a pull. My best pull by far in this month 16. Compare him to Jamie Collins. Murders him in speed. Murders him in strength. Same excel, same tackling. A little bit better play rec. Amazing block. Damn, this is a really good card. If I had more coins, I might keep him, but... Right now, I'm pretty sure he'll drop down again. He was going for around 150, 120K before, but what a way to end it. Let's go check out, see if Pat McPhee might go for some coin. And Okay, another 15K pull. Not a bad pack opening at all. And we might keep Gilmore, might sell him. I don't really need another corner. I already have Jimmy Smith along with Norman and Malcolm Butler, but it couldn't hurt to add another one. Maybe sell one of the other three corners. How much is he going for right now? 30k. I might have to sell him. I think his price is going to drop more since he's going to be in packs a little bit longer than Julio. But we'll see. See what's going on in the next video. Anyway, thank you for coming to my channel. If you did enjoy, please comment, like, and subscribe. More Mutt, fit, more Mutt 16 coming in the future.